it's Stephanie Grams. I thought I'd just come on here and talk to you for a minute while my daughters run into the library. Um, I like to tell stories related to the keepsake business industry. And um, a story I have for you is when I first started offering memory bear services, I wasted so much time in all these individual memory bear groups and maker forums. I was always looking for information and I always had a dozen questions and when you ask a question in a group everybody wants to be helpful but just you you know you could ask one simple question and get one or two dozen replies and answers and there's no one answer better than another one typically and so one thing that I realized was I wasn't moving forward in my business reaching my milestones and my goals because I was spending so much time looking all over the internet for answers to my questions. And part of that problem was, um, is I didn't know what I didn't know. And you have to keep in mind, I've been a business owner um, for, for decades. Um, I started sewing 40 years ago, and then I started selling what I was sewing over 30 years ago so it's not like I was brand new to the industry itself um, I've been a sewist and a textile artist for years um, but when I took that leap and crossed from a um, textile artist into a um, just a sewist in general um, into the keepsake business industry things changed drastically um, and not just for me, but I see that with my students at the Keepsake Business um, Academy also, is we found out that we've wasted so much time asking questions um, and really not getting the answer that we needed. Um, so going back to why I did what I did, I, I started writing down all the questions that I had. And I actually kept a log through like taking screenshots and filing those away in my email and just kept adding to my knowledge and database, um, my knowledge base, creating my own database. And so I, I just kept continuing to add to my knowledge and learning and I took some extra courses. Uh, meanwhile, I took the 15 plus years of being an online business manager with a specialty in um, coding public relations, outreach, research, and things like that. And that's how I came up with the Keepsake Business Academy. And um, my 99% of my time is with my students in the academy. And there's that 1% that I occasionally accept a memory bear order. It has to be a um, very specific reason or purpose um, why I take that order. Um, typically, it's from somebody that knows me personally, um, and then what I do with people that don't really know me personally and they need a bear, I will contact one of my students and ask them if this is something they're interested in. Um, so that's something else I like to do in the community is ask my students if they accept referrals, and um, and then of course I ask the customer if they are interested in um, being referred to one of my students. Um, I, I feel more comfortable uh, referring business to my students because I know that they have the skills needed along with the mindset and, the, and all of that that goes into taking care, really good care of a customer. Um, but that was my story for today. I, I can always come on here and share some more. If you're interested, maybe you're an aspiring memory bear maker, maybe you're new to it, maybe you're struggling to grow beyond where you're at now, and you're finding yourself asking questions in groups and forums and private messages, and you're just wasting your time, it's really worth the investment to come on over to the Academy. Um, the low price I have on there now ends um, April 1st, 2024. Um, on that day at midnight Eastern time, I have to increase the rate because the platform and all the materials that I, I put into it, those also increase in um, price. So I do have to increase my price, but I hope to get to know you. 
um, and your goals with your memory bear and keepsake business. It's pretty much open to anyone that is an adult that can make their own um, decisions. So I don't really try to keep it within a certain age range. I, I have students from 18 clear up to 70 years old in the Keepsake Business Academy. Um, and, you know, I, I just think that if you have the right mindset with the desire to help your customers and increase that value, definitely come on over and introduce yourself. All right, guys, it's Stephanie Grams. Have a great day.